Hey guys, um, we just thought to uh, spice our run up a little bit. Now we've found some shade. We'll just do a couple of uh, off the cuff interview questions. We're not planning this, so it'll go horribly one, I'm sure. And we're right next to a train line, so I'm sure another train will come past in a minute. So, um, yeah, right. So, question one, Daryl. This is a hot seat now. Yeah. Um, what race would you most like to do in this country? Um, I think, and I've just having just got my good for age accepted, having never done it before, is London. Yeah, I had, to chuck, I had to chuck that one in chuck there, didn't you? In. Just because I didn't get in yet. Yeah. Um, and yeah. on that one, we'd be interested to know your thoughts on uh, the good for age process and uh, whether you think it's the right way to do things or not. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. Uh, morning. Hello. See, everybody's using this park. Great place to run. So, uh, next question for you is... What is your favourite distance and why? Uh, going back many years in my track days, I used to love to run the steeplechase because that was my preferred attempt on track. I'd probably say my favourite distance was the 1500 metres. Oh. Quick, short, um, yeah, most middle distance runners can adapt to it quite easily and yeah, beautiful to race in the summer. I'm guessing now you probably, in the nicest uh, sense, getting on a bit and uh, oh, totally. maybe I haven't got those legs anymore. No, no. I'm, I'm not even as old as him and I still can't do it on 1500, so. And then final question, just as a little bit of fun. Who is one of your role models in running? We'll try and tag them if we can find them. Hopefully they use any social media platforms. I've got quite a few actually. So going back, you know, years, people like Co Vet Cram, um, the era in the 80s where Britain dominated and that's certainly down to probably the reason why I started running in the first place but even up to late really, just a lot of the, the up and coming Brits I think we've got some great young talent out there which actually, yeah, I'm really, I'm really excited about and I think, you know, hopefully, you know, we can continue that that journey that we've been on in distance running for the next few years with what's what's coming through so yeah, yeah without mentioning names but there's plenty of young guys i'm excited to see yeah, improve I, I agree with that i think and i think uh, just going back to good for age i think uh, the fact they've had to lower the times this year just shows there's a lot more quicker runners out there you know both elite semi-elite and uh, whatnot so anyway we've reached the end of the trail now so we're going to start getting a little bit sweaty into the sun so that was just a quick little interview enjoy your day guys bye